Hey Geeks, Tim with MajorGeeks.com. Today we're going to show you how to disable the registry editor in Windows. Now, as with anything else, there's more than one way to do it. Of course, we can use Group Policy Editor, but let's keep in mind you can also do it with RegEdit. Now, let's think about that for a minute. If you disable RegEdit, it's going to be kind of hard to open RegEdit to re-enable it if you change your mind. That's okay, maybe you won't, but my suggestion would be use Group Policy Editor. If you don't have it, your Windows 10 Home, click this link. Follow this video, run the batch file, and you're off to the races. Uh, the link to this article will be in the video description so that you can find these links. All right, let's get to work. We're going to go to User Configuration Administrative Template System. So let's do Windows Key Plus R and do gpedit.msc. Hit Enter. And as we said, User Configuration Administrative Templates System. Look over here to your right and prevent access to registry editing tools. Click enabled and optionally you can disable the regedit from running silently. I would leave it at yes and click OK and regedit will be disabled. So we go Windows key plus R, regedit, denied. There you go. Change your mind. Double click. Not configured. OK. And we're good to go. So now if you want to play with a registry, of course, the nice thing about that is if you're managing multiple computers, you could just export a batch file and deploy it. Although that's up to you. So let's open a registry editor, which we now know we can run and highlight this line right here. Win R. RegEdit, clear this out, press Control V, and then hit Enter. Hit Enter, I said. What happened? Oh, I'm there. So, I don't know where I got that from. As you can see, we are looking to get to Software Policies Microsoft Windows System. There is no system key here. So, you're going to have to create that key with it by, by right-clicking on the word Windows new key name it system now we're gonna to have to create a new D word on the right side and as you can see right here we're going to name it disable registry tools right click new D word 32-bit value using control V let's put disable registry tools in there now we're going to want to double click it and set the value data as you can see, value data one will disable it. Double click, change the zero to a one. And let's run regedit. Yep, we have to reboot for that to work. But you get the idea. Change that back to zero if you change your mind. And again, sometimes you have to log out, sometimes you don't. In this case, it looks like I do. Change it back to zero. And of course, don't forget. Another thing you can do, since you know you created the key, if you want to get rid of it completely and you're sure, just delete the system key that you created. So right click on system, click on delete, and click on yes. But regardless, you're probably not even listening anymore because you should have done it with group policy or it makes life a lot easier. There you go. That is how to disable the registry edit, editor, regedit in Windows 10. As always, we thank you for watching. See ya.